This tutorial will cover how to enhance your audio using the equalizer and compressor. I'm just going to show you bass boost today, but you can play around with the other options in the equalizer. Bass boost will give your voice a warmer, less distant sound. Select your track and click on the effect tab. Go down to equalization. You can see that bass boost is the default and select curve. Go ahead and click OK and you can see how the waveform changed. It's good to do bass boost after having done noise reduction, since bass boost amplifies the sound. If you go back to the equalization window, you will find that there are other options under select curve. Treble boost, or top end, will give your voice a more crisp and clear sound. Telephone is just what it sounds like, and causes your voice to sound like it's coming through a telephone. As I said earlier, you can play around with the rest of the other options. Compression is good for evening out the volume of your track. It reduces the dynamic range and amplifies sound without clipping. It basically brings the loudest points in the waveform down to the quietest points. To compress your sound, select the track, go to Effect, and Compressor. The default settings are usually good enough. The only thing that might need adjusting is the threshold, which you want to keep between negative 10 and negative 16 decibels. Make sure you have the makeup gain box checked because this will automatically amplify your sound after compressing it. Once you click OK, you can see that the sound is amplified. You can repeat the compression if your results are not to your liking. However, it is possible to over compress your sound. Too much compression will cause you to lose some of the effects that you created with the equalizer. And that's pretty much all you need to know about compression and equalization in Audacity.